It's, you were doing a wheelie a second ago. Now you don't want to? But no, I'll do one. All right. I'll do one. Hang on. Let's see. Let's see. The kids yeah. Think I'm cool. <sighs> it's like the first wheelie ever been on my channel. What? <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> I'm here with Jeremy Powers. Uh, Mount Washington Hill Climb is this weekend. Uh, so I came a few days early to, to bro out with my boy. Jeremy! We're in Southampton? Which Hampton are you living in? Uh, yes. One of the, one of the Hamptons. Yeah, we're not those Hamptons, not the fancy Hamptons. The Massachusetts hippie Hamptons, right? That's right. Is that fair? Yeah. We're doing mostly pavement. He took me on some gravel today, which is not what I'm equipped for. No, but I had to warm him up. You never know when you're coming to gravel and I wanted to make sure his skills were on point and he was up to snuff for what New England may throw at him. You never know, Phil. I'm being tested. You never know. Uh, and anyway, we're gonna do this little quick video. Uh, to go through what what I did to my bike for the Mount Washington Hill Climb. We'll give a check to Jeremy's bike, who's never done this particular bicycle event. You're just gonna wheelie up the whole thing, right? No, no. Come on. No, no, no. Come on, buddy. Spider oh, in! Get him! Get him! Oh, that's it? That's all you got? All right. Oh! So when I was up in Big Bear, I told you that VeloFix came by. They had the, the code to my garage. Uh, I told you they came by to, to take care of my uphill bike. Uh, today I'm going to show you what they did to it, what I found when I got home. We're now here in uh, in Jeremy Powers' garage, which is I'm I'm not going to say I'm not going to say you're a hoarder, but I'm also not going to absolve you of hoarding. You just got, he's got a lot of cool stuff, you know. You got a lot of cool race stuff. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. The thought was, because Jeremy's never done this hill climb, we're gonna, I'm gonna show him what I've done with my bike, uh, my my hill climb setup, and then we'll we'll have a look at his and and make sure you're uh, you're safe to to get up it. Yeah, yeah, I'd love to get this up before so that I can avoid making some mistakes, but hopefully, social media or something will guide us right away, or you can help me. Yeah, 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 we'll talk it through. Um, I'll I'll attempt to steer you in the right direction. Okay. Um, yeah, we're friends. We go back. I wouldn't. You know, I wouldn't take you up a hill you couldn't you couldn't manage. You're gonna okay. be fine. Okay. I've got the the rim brake uh, factor van, super light, fancy carbon. Um, the the tweaks we've done to it. So rim brake, people are like oh people love it. A lot of the old school bike dorks. When's the last time you rode a rim brake? 2016. <laughs> yeah, that sounds right. The old school bike dorks. Every time I I, I have this bike, they're like oh awesome, love rim brakes. Cause they think like I'm sticking it to the man. No, I, I almost always ride disc brakes. Uh, this is worse. Cause I'm actually going to take one of the brakes off for the hill climb. Uh, you just pull cause they don't let you ride down is the deal. Cause it's definitely not safe. Um, otherwise we've got the, you know, we got the, the, the Wahoo pedals. We've got a, the chain ring situation is a little bit dorkier than usual. Um, I've got a, a one by setup cause you don't need a big ring. Uh, so this is a 34 and then a 34 in the back. That's a 12, 34. Uh, and to run that, I had to run an XTR derailleur. Um, I've also got the, the, the special occasion uh, Silka chain on there with the, the wax treatment on it. I've got the, um, this guy to keep the chain going. Um, I do have two Silka cages on at the moment. I'm probably gonna pull, I think I'm gonna pull both of those. Do you, would, I, would you drink for a 51 minute? What'd you do in cyclocross? Did you do, no, you wouldn't even, did you bring a bottle in, in, in your races if back in the day? It was hot, but it won't be hot. No drinking, nothing at all. That's so weird. And then the the carbon saddle. The, this is the stealth with the carbon rails. Uh, the same. It's it's like almost my usual setup. Uh, these are not the wheels I'll race on. These are the the clinchers. My my race wheels are in here. These are the tubular uh, Durace Canada Tire 28s situation going on there. You could buy super light parts for your bike. You could buy you know really geeky whatevers. Or you could just remove the entire, if you really want to lose weight, just have one break. That's the, the, the hack, you know, is to literally hack, saw your, your items. The thing I'm worried about is that you're going to be pushing so much more power than me by like more, more power. I mean, like I'll probably maybe even twice as much for the entire time. Okay. And you've got a bike that's about 10 pounds lighter than mine. So I'm not sure that I'm looking for advice. Well, all right, let's have a look. Let's see what you got. Okay. Yeah, Jeremy, what the what the fuck is this syringe? What the fuck is this? What are you up to in here? I knew it. <laughs> What's this weird tandem bike you've got here? That's when you have two kids. You, Jeremy's put a lot of time and thought into this setup, right? Well, I actually, I haven't put a lot of time and thought into it, but <laughs> I did surprise myself that I was able to do uh, what I had to do here. 
So yeah, we got the old Orbea Orca with the custom paint. How old is it? The, a couple of years. These are this is GCN stuff. Okay, uh, okay. From back in the day. You'll know if you follow me along the years, I still ride the Time uh, RXS yep. pedals. Okay. These are the old, old, old ones. I scour eBay and buy up the old stock that I find um, <laughs> so that I don't have to ever switch. You know, don't break. Uh, You've got precious knees. If it's not broken, don't mm -hmm. fix it, right? And I, I just, so anyways, I'm not leaving those. Okay. I did figure out the, I had an old, um, this is a 42. Uh, cyclocross chainring on here. We were talking about this chainring being a potential go to Stephen Hyde's house and, and find a, a smaller one. I, I've, I've secured a 40. Just there in case. There are 40s available. I've secured a 40. Right. This, this is a, I'm pretty sure it's a 50. That's a big, that's a big cassette. Yeah. The I'm sure it's thing, a 10, 50. I don't know. Movie. See, this is where I get is I've got the wax treatment thing. Efficiency wise, I'm not sure if that's that great. You're probably better off with a smaller front chain ring, yeah, 10, and then you're 50. kind of in the middle, 10, than, than having your chain stretched. Ten fifty. Here's 10, here's yeah. the thing. I'm not going to be thinking about that when I'm pedaling two hundred watts at six thousand feet on top of Mount okay. Washington. Okay. I'm really not. I'm just going to be thinking of yeah, my speak, legs hurt. Just be getting just... up it and cursing my name is what I and hope. Basically, will yes. You've got Mavic wheels. Uh, if you're trying to discuss if those they, exist if anymore, they're still in business. I don't know. I've got the Pirelli tires on here. These are tubeless. Okay. No, this is a this is a yeah. bar that I wrapped all the way here. I got the head unit on here. <laughs> wrap, why'd you wrap it all the way to the? Don't note? worry about it. I was trying to cover <laughs> up who the sponsor was at the time. Oh, ultra top secret I'm stuff. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm yeah. sorry. I'm this sorry. is the only seat that I really like anymore. I'm very particular. I got weird things. Okay. No. It's, you know, listen. That's fine. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah. Probably. I, I think. I think this is gonna be. I think you're gonna be all right. You're gonna get I'm, up it. I'm gonna ride with a water bottle and a lot of gels and things like that. Oh. And, <laughs> and yeah. And if if I if you're I gonna, don't peanut butter and gel. And if I don't, yeah, I'm gonna literally like bring like one of those small kind of like compact triangular lawn chairs. If I gave you the camera and a selfie stick, would you like talk at it while you ride, or is that gonna be a pain in the butt? No, no, no. I think I'm more there. You're there to race. I'm there to capture the vibe. Okay. To, right. The part you don't see, I'm gonna see. All right. I'm giving you this. Yeah. And you can interview people, and they're gonna be so mad. You're, they're gonna hate it. The thing about this that's interesting is that like I've never been less fit, and. Uh, I'm doing the probably like the hardest hill climb thing I've ever done in my entire life. So thank you very much. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> that is true. But you know what? It's it's a bucket list thing. So we're, yeah, we got to do it. I'm excited. No, oh, that's the thing. It's yeah. like you never get to ride up Mount You're Washington. You're gonna love it. I am, I yeah. You, have you driven up it? You've been there. I've, I've looked at it. It's we, a very New England thing. Every second car on the highway from Boston had I, a Mount I my, have, yeah, my I have, car, like I have, Exactly. I have a friend that lives across the way and you mm -hmm. look at Mount Washington all the time. I just, yeah, it's, uh, yeah you can't ride your bike up it. So there's been no... But now we're here, All right, and so we're doing it. I don't think you're not scared. You, you seem you're not intimidated. No, you're 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 reasonable. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not um, freaked out. It is gonna be. I think it's gonna be hard though. I oh do, yeah, no, you're gonna be. Like, you're gonna be mad. Yeah, you're gonna be mad. Gonna but be in like in a funny way, you're good yeah. at being funny, man. Yeah, it's, it's like be Jerry bad. Seinfeld kind of yelling yeah. and every, yeah. I'm that's, looking. That's for, I'm looking forward to the challenge. Perfect. All right, sweet. All right, so Jeremy got his uh his small chain ring. Yep. And instead of looking at like gear charts, we're just gonna do the pro cyclist version of math where we're both in our easiest gear and we're gonna see if he's got enough uh, compared to me. So I'm in the 34, 34. Okay. And I'm on the 40, 50, yep. going up. Oh gosh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is quality videoing here. Hi. You're gonna, you're Cadence. coasting. All you're right. coasting up Mount Washington, dude. I hope so. Coasting. I'm you're gonna fine. Eat this. You're fine. All right, we're here at the race venue at a hotel right by the start. Uh, so my bike is now race ready, uh, races tomorrow. So I'll go through the final kind of prep. We've got, uh, I took, took the housing out and uh, the rear brake came off. So that's a few grams. We got the race wheels, of course, uh, the carbon uh, tubulars, Kenda Volare tubulars are 24C. So I'll pump that up to like 100, something like that. Um, but that's that's it, that's the, that's the full setup. Um, let's do the final weigh in, shall we? I lost weight for this, so so did my bike. Final is just a little bit over 13. So not bad for a uh, you know a stock, basically bike. Like these, none of these. There's no crazy parts on here. Um, everything is sponsor correct. Uh, this is all stuff you know you can just get at the bike shop. So you know there's plenty of bikes that are going to be lighter than that and crazier than that. Um, but this is uh, this should do it. This should do it for me. The local term for. Mount Washington is the rock pile. That's why. 